Hi guys, it's Diamond from the Oppenheimer Ranch Project on Thursday, September 21st, 2017, around noon time. It's really windy. The weather's changed here in Colorado. Early onset of winter, and it's still summer. We still have another day. <laughs> but I wanted to come back to this beam I was going to put in and show you guys how to do it instead of uh, doing it without you watching. Because I'm going to save money by making my own beam. And in the industry, they call this a glue arm or a glue laminate or a laminated beam. But I'm going to show you how to make your own glue laminated beam or glue arm uh, right now. And what you do is you take your wood, whatever wood you want to make a beam out of, and you crown it. All that means is you want to find the banana side, the bow side up. And you see I drew a simple picture here for you. If you can see it. Where I looked, I looked down the wood. And I found that it bowed upwards. So you want to make sure you get that side up so that you can your beam will take weight correctly. <coughs> then you want to know how thick your beam is. My beam had to be uh, about three and a half inches. So these two beams together only are three. So I want to add a little bit of strength in the middle. And I do that in the form of this half inch spacer, uh, which is in this case OSB. And that gives me a little strength from this way. And then you want to glue it all together and nail it all together. So I'm going to do that real quick for you. Alrighty. Looks nice. Make sure it's all centered. When you nail this, you, know, you want to make sure it's not overlapping here because that's just more work to do. There's your glue lamp. Now I have a huge beam that will hold weight. Instead of paying five dollars a foot for this, it's probably half the price. <coughs> and there it's in. Now the whole front <coughs> of the barn can be open and I could build a door. Now, the reason I use two by six up there instead of two by 10 is because this is gonna be a facade wall and it's not gonna hold the roof weight. So I save money by doing that. I hope that helped you save some money building your own beam. Thanks for watching.